Hello and welcome to this short lesson on how to download free Indian Remote Sensing Satellite Data from Bhuvan which is a geo portal for India developed by the Indian Space Research Organization or ISRO. So to reach Bhuvan uh, just open your browser and type in this link right here. I've provided this link in the description of this video so we're going to go straight to the Bhuvan landing page and this is the landing page for Bhuvan uh, there are a lot many things that can actually be accessed from this particular page but at this particular point in time we are interested in the open data archive right here so we're going to just click on this and as you click on this you are taken to the open data archive um, you have to log in um, to download satellite data so you can just click on this login button right here and you have to enter your username and password if you do not have one you can create one from this link new user by providing very simple details by filling in a very simple form. I already have my user ID and password so I'm just going to go and fill my credentials. And log in. So when you log in, um, your username is reflected right here and one of the first things that you need to do is to select the satellite sensor so using this little drop down here we are going to pick up resource at one there are some other satellites that can also be chosen but for this we will be choosing resource at one list three you are now presented with a map of India and the map of India is covered with tiles so you have to now define the area uh, for which you want to download the satellite imagery which can be done in a number of different ways which includes giving coordinates um, giving the topographic map sheet number this is remember the new series number and some other uh, tools as well like interactive drawing etc so we are going to choose map sheet I'm going to provide and I'll be working with um, uh, uh, a satellite image of Bhopal which is a town in central India I'm going to go here and type in the name of this town and I have some options so I'm going to choose the first one Bhopal is located in the state of Madhya Pradesh in India so I'm going to click this and immediately I am shown the location of this city Bhopal and I want to know the map sheet number so I'm just going to go and click on this I which is the identity of the tile tool click on this and do a mouse over on this tile so you will immediately see that the map number is being shown as um, F43 F08 and we can see that um, we have imagery from 2009, 2011, 2012 and 2013 um, for this particular tile. So I'm going to just take a note of this uh, tile ID which is F43F08 and I'm just going to come here and enter that particular number F43F08 and the moment I type this I have these images displayed right here I can check out the metadata which is very useful you can scroll down and see which satellite took this imagery and this is resource at 2 the sensor is list 3 this is the path this is the row and this is the date when the image was acquired this is 23 October 2009 
and this is the pixel size in degrees which you can obviously also convert into meters so you can read a little bit about this you can also have a snapshot thumbnail view of this uh, satellite imagery if you were interested but I'm interested to download this image so I'm just going to come here and press the download button and I have um, this download link activated and I can just press OK to start downloading my file so once your download is complete um, you just unzip the file and this is what you see inside the unzip folder you have four bands and some metadata information um, now we just want to read this inside PrimeWin so we will start PrimeWin and we just click on utilities and we click on data import um, and then we choose resource sat2 so recall that the file that has been downloaded was acquired by resource sat2 it's in the TIFF format so we're going to click on this button right here so we have to um, first go and pick up one of these files one of these four band files which is in the unzip folder so the moment you do that uh, all the four bands start showing up in this box right here we now have to provide an output file name so we are just going to click on this button and come here and give it a name I'm going to say Popal October 2009 list 3 and this is an important step right here so what you need to do is you need to also give the file extension .tif if you don't do this uh, you will end up creating a file that would not be recognized so it's very important that after you give the name you also give the extension .tif so once you have done that uh, you can just simply press save and another important step is that you have to drag and select all the four bands so once all the four bands in this box are blue and you have given your output file name you are good to go you can just click on import uh, you are notified that the data import has been successful so we are going to say OK exit I'm going to get rid of these menus and to see your file which you have downloaded and imported inside PrimeIn we'll just click on viewer go to file go to open and here is our file which is a combined single file having all the four bands the one that we have just saved and we can just click on it and say open so you might encounter a small error but you can just dismiss it um, this is the viewer so we can just enlarge it a little bit and now I have my four list three bands right here so as you are aware band 1 is green, band 2 is red, band 3 is uh, near infrared and band 4 is short wave infrared so I'm going to create a false color composite so I'll assign band 3 the, short, the near infrared band to the red gun uh, the red band to the green gun and the green band to the blue gun and all I have to do is to just press load and close so here is my image um, I can just right click and fit it to the window which I have um, increased a little bit just to make the image bigger and then I can right click and apply a contrast stretch let me apply a histogram equalization stretch so this is the this is how you can actually download uh, satellite data from Bhuvan uh, and then import it inside PrimeWin I have provided a KML file on the course page which you can open in Google Earth and familiarize yourself with this area of Popal if you are um, 
not comfortable working with this image of Bhopal, you can actually use uh, a Landsat image or image from another satellite and um, view it in PrimeWin. But for subsequent lessons uh, in this short course, we will be using this particular image. Thanks for watching.